All right. So some people will say that, uh, you know, why are gays so proud of themselves? You know, why is there such thing as gay pride? Uh, because especially if they say that they're born that way, what is to be uh, to be proud of being born a certain way? You know, people who are left handed uh, aren't proud of themselves. People who are who say that they're straight, they're not proud. So why is it that the gays get to be proud? Now, I don't know if, if this is a problem with people of a lack of empathy or a lack of historical understanding. I hope it's the second, because if it's a lack of historical understanding, we can go through the history and we can try to get people to understand. Um, but if it's a lack of empathy, well, you know, that's kind of a lost cause. But anyway, so uh, the first gay pride parade in the United States was in 1970. Uh, and it was the purpose of it was to commemorate the Stonewall in riots, which happened the year before in, 19, in June of 1969. And what happened was that the gays really didn't have any bars, at least legally. Uh, the New York, you know, because New York was run like a communist Sharia law dictatorship, you couldn't open a bar uh, without getting a liquor license from the state. And the state said, if there's a single homosexual in a bar, that that bar will be closed down. Now, there were a couple illegal bars in seedy places run by the mob. Um, you know, and, and they had to be bribed. They, they had to bribe police officers to keep them open. But a lot of the times they were raided nonetheless. They just wanted to beat up gays or just wanted to make a hassle. So... Uh, in, in June of 1969, uh, they raided the Stonewall Inn, and the gays had enough. So they fought back and beat the crap out of the police. And, you know, uh, it was it lasted for a couple of days, uh, the tensions in the, in the city or the neighborhood. Um, and, and during that time, you know, if people knew that you were gay, uh, you could be fired from your job, your lease would be denied, you know, and those were really bad things. So when in 1970 they wanted to commemorate Stonewall Inn, the Gay Pride Parade was about was not about ooh we're so proud of being born gay, uh, something we can't change or help or whatever, but we're we're really proud of the fact that some of us are open, uh, who can be open and honest enough to put our faces in public and say we're gay, and it doesn't matter if they fire us, doesn't matter if they kick us out of our houses, uh, we're just going to stand up and not take it anymore. So that's what gay pride is about. It's about saying fuck it to the rest of the world uh, who wants to oppose gays. Now, another interesting side note is that many gays in the 1960s and 70s uh, subscribed to social constructivist uh, views on sexual orientation. So they looked at a lot of the ancient history that we at Guerrero look at and say, wait a second, most men in ancient times were attracted to other men. Uh, most men had a bisexual potential. Uh, so it's it's sort of interesting that in the early gay rights movement in this country in the 60s and 70s, a lot of people certainly did not think that all there was to gays was them being born that way. So it's it's not so again it's not about be, it's not about being proud about be, having been born a certain way, but being proud of being open about who you are and not giving a rat's ass about what others think. So that's the short summary.